just for the person that I'm touching on the shoulder right now. The person I'm touching on the shoulder right now, focus on the sound of my voice. In a moment, I'm going to say that special word that helps you open your eyes. When I say that special word, you'll open your eyes, you'll feel alert and refreshed. When your eyes open, you feel quite nice, quite positive. And when your eyes are open, the very first time when your eyes are open that I say the word campus, the very first time when your eyes are open that I say the word campus, you're no longer yourself, you're more than yourself. When your eyes are open and I say the word campus, you are a Marine Corps drill instructor. You are the special liaison officer assigned to this school. You have the new recruits, it's your job to get them ready. You have to teach them, you gotta get them in shape. You, you, you're very good at your job. You love your job, you create exceptional leaders, you're very good at your job. While you're doing your duties as a drill instructor, at any point while you're doing your duties as a drill instructor, if I snap my fingers outside your ear like this, you go back to being your normal self, your usual self. But when your eyes are open and I say the word campus, you are a Marine Corps drill instructor. Do you ever stand on your head for me? That's right, just relax. Yeah. Um, the person that I'm touching on the shoulder right now, the okay. person I'm touching on the shoulder right now, in a few moments I'll say that special word that helps you open your eyes. When I say that special word, you'll open your eyes, you'll be alert, refreshed, you feel wonderful, very positive, very relaxed and refreshed. And when your eyes are open, any time when your eyes are open that I say the word exciting, Anytime when your eyes are open that I say the word exciting, something interesting, curious, a little bit strange happens. Whenever your eyes are open and I say the word exciting, your nipples itch. And then, of course, when things itch, what do we do? We scratch them, right? And that makes total sense. But when you scratch them, then they tickle. Whenever your eyes are open and I say the word exciting, your nipples itch. But then when you scratch them, they tickle. The more often that I say the word exciting, the more they itch. The more you scratch them, the more they tickle. It's that time of year that your is very dry. I understand <laughs> person that I'm touching on the shoulder right now, the person I'm touching on the shoulder right now, in a few moments I'll say that special word that helps you open your eyes. When I say that special word, you'll open your eyes, you'll be alert, refreshed, and when your eyes are open, anytime when your eyes are open that I say the word Washington, anytime when your eyes are open that I say the word or the name Washington, you get the most big, amazing feeling of energy. This big, beautiful, amazing feeling of energy. It's so big and powerful. It's so amazingly big and powerful and wonderful. It's as if you were struck by happy lightning. Whenever I say Washington, it's like the happy lightning goes right through your body. It's so big and powerful, it has to get out. It has to escape. And it comes out of your mouth in the form of the words, who's your daddy? Whenever your eyes are open and I say Washington, who's your daddy? It comes right out of your mouth. Big, amazing, powerful. It makes you so happy to do it. The more you do it, the better you feel. And the person that I'm touching on the shoulder right now, the person I'm touching on the shoulder right now, in a few moments, I'll say that special word that helps you open your eyes. When I say that special word, you'll open your eyes, you'll be alert, refreshed, you feel wonderful, very positive, very refreshed. When your eyes are open, anytime when your eyes are open that I say hypnosis, anytime when your eyes are open that I say hypnosis, someone's blowing in your ear and it really, really tickles. Whenever your eyes are open and I say the word <laughs> hypnosis, someone's blowing in your ear and it really, really tickles. Now, I don't like to give out all of my suggestions at once. I like to share them all night long. If you didn't get a suggestion this time, that's fine. You're doing great. In fact, you're doing so great. The audience loves you. They appreciate you. The next time I say the special word, you'll open your eyes, you'll be alert and refreshed. And when the, your eyes open, the audience is gonna give you a big round of applause. The more they clap and cheer for you, the better it makes you feel. The more genuinely wonderful, positive, and joyful it makes you feel in your heart, and you deserve it. You're beautiful, talented, and gifted. Let yourself one, two, three, awake. Aren't they doing a good job? So this is the part where I like to check in a little bit and know what I work with. How many of you have done hypnosis before? One. Only one of you. The rest of you are all first timers. That's wonderful. Good for you. It's easy for you because you know it's nice, right? You know it's, it's fun and it's, it feels good. And for the rest of you that's your first time, that's wonderful. Good for you. So you'll find probably, I mean, right off, it's, it's hard to explain what it's like to do hypnosis, right? I mean, because you, you pretty much just feel like yourself, you know? You just feel you're like, I'm me, right? You're conscious, you know, you're awake. People probably ask you after the show, they may come up to you, and, and even after tonight, you may be walking across campus, and someone might come up to you and say, weren't you in that hypnosis show? And then, so just be prepared for that, it could happen. <laughs> Frustrated, what's the matter? They're not in uniform! Why aren't you in uniform? 
Is, is there a rule that they do they have to wear uniform? They're supposed to wear a uniform on campus. On campus. Yeah. Who's in charge of that kind of thing? Me. It's probably like that means it's, you're gonna be to blame, aren't you? I mean you just Go get in uniform, Dante! <laughs> Okay, I know. Are you don't seem to have a healthy respect for authority here. I don't know what to do about that. They don't know. They don't know. Do you, does this happen a lot to you? No, it doesn't. No. How long have you been doing this job? Ten years. Ten years. <laughs> you must be good at it to last at it that long. Yeah. What do you normally do in a typical day? What kind of stuff do you do? I make them do push-ups. Push-ups? Miles. Running miles? That's intense. All these... But they're not even wearing uniforms right now. Yeah. No. Here's the other thing I wanted to ask you, though. It's, tell me your name again. I'm Tom. Tom. And you've never been hypnotized before? No. Are you kind of curious about it? Yeah. I think you'll find it's very exciting to do it. I think you'll enjoy it. And so I've got all these chairs. Why don't you sit down in a chair and just enjoy yourself, and we'll do some hypnosis. You're like, you're having a fun time. It's exciting. Oh, it's glad to hear It's nice, right? What is, what's up with your ear? Who does? Who blows in your ear? Are you blowing in your ear? She says you're going in. She says she's not. Are you sure it's her? Well, you know what? There is like a draft, though. I feel it too. Because look, it even makes the things move. You know what? Just to be safe, here, watch. Come around here. Come on, we gotta see. We'll move you down here and see if we can get you out of the draft. I think it's just a. Joe, Joe, what's up with you? What are you doing? I'm like itchy, but when I tickle it, I just laugh. <laughs> well, that's not so bad. That's. No? I stop and it's just itchy and then I'm like, <laughs> you, you said that the first time. Um, that's, <laughs> that's exciting. I mean, it's not every day that something, yeah, right? I know. It's better. So we were talking about hypnosis down here. There's, what? Still? Now her. You're going to blame her now? Only this year. All right, here's what we'll do. Come down here. Right here. We'll put you down on the end where there's no one to the left of you. And then it will be impossible, right? Because there'll be no one that could possibly, right? Smart. That's why I'm not just, there's a lot going on. We've got hypnosis and all this other. <laughs> I like your laugh. That's nice. Look, it was just tickly kind of. There's no one here. How do you explain that? It's a draft. It's a draft. There's, look, it makes the things move. That's what it is. You got a lot of wind on this campus, and the things. <laughs> There's no laughing subordination. Really? Uh, uh, <laughs> Laughing it up. It's just a big joke to them. They don't appreciate it. No, they got all their technology out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Just camping it up, doing their own thing. I don't know, because it's funny. If you just really think about it, I don't even know. Why are you here right now? I came. I work for a program. Right. 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 That's what. Okay, good. We'll sit in your chair and we'll have a good time. It's going to be exciting. This next thing that we do, Tom, you're going to like it. It's going to be. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Alright, we got something cool to do. Feet flat, seatbelts are on, and then you can sleep. <laughs> deeper and deeper, more and more relaxed. Take a moment right now and erase any and all earlier suggestions. You don't need any of those earlier suggestions. We have something much more exciting, much more wonderful. You have a wonderful opportunity. In a moment, I'm going to say that special word that helps you open your eyes once again. When I say that special word, you'll open your eyes, you'll be alert, refreshed. And when your eyes open,